Hey guys, it's me, your local trash can. Today I am just doing a vlog. Right now it is, I think it's March 21st. First? March 21st. And my room is trash. So to all of you saying that I should do a room tour, I will do one when my room is like actually clean and like my room isn't done. Like does this look done to you? No. My tapestry fell down. I my couch is a bed. I look like this. <laughs> and also my SD card is janked. So I'm filming on my vlogging camera right now. Just figured that I'd start a vlog and I can just end it whenever I want. Um, today I stayed home from school because I'm me. And I, yeah, <laughs> I wanted to give a shout out to Naima. She is actually like a close friend of mine. I didn't meet her through YouTube. Like she's actually my friend. And she wanted me to tell you her Snapchat. So I'm going to tell you her Snapchat. It is XOX Naima. So you should add her. She's like a bitch trying to get famous. So that's my life. Also, I wanted to show you this swimsuit. So my grade is going to Costa Rica in April. And I bought a swimsuit. So I bought this one. I think it's really cute. It's, um, I got it from Target. <laughs> so you like, it pushes them up, but like in a natural way. It doesn't make me look like I have like a giant boob crack. Hey guys, so I am fucked. Basically, I'm fucked. <laughs> so I have all of these note cards yes yeah, so basically I'm doing a research paper and my topic is cheap labor in Bangladesh and I have to have 60 note cards by tomorrow um, by the time I go to school it's 636 right now oh my god six times six is 36 <laughs> and these are all my note cards I've sorted them out by sources my first source second source third source you know, I need to keep going. And then this is my thesis. It is, as Bangladesh's ready-made garment industry brings economic growth, its strains on social sustainability are doing the country more harm than good. So I'm reading this book called Where Am I Wearing? And his underwear was made in Bangladesh. So now I'm reading about some guy's underwear and he's going to Bangladesh to see like what the working conditions are like. But shout out to Danielle Lloyd because she just told me where to get those acrylic containers that I hold my lip stuff in that I love. And she's, the, even though this is the British Amazon, they're on on Amazon and so I'm so excited so shout out to you girl thank you so much for helping me out like ah, I'm so excited I'm still doing this I'm still suicidal <laughs> I need more note cards and I also need food hey guys so I have two boxes from Ulta so I thought that I would open them for you so I'm gonna open them and I will be right back honestly I was having a bad day and no this is makeup I'm so happy okay so in the first one I'm really excited I have this Urban Decay D Slick makeup setting spray because I don't have any oil control setting sprays the old packaging because they repackaged their setting sprays so the old ones were on sale for $19 or something when I they were like half off so I got the D Slick one and I also got the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm so excited. I've been wanting to try this out for so long. This like outer box is very underwhelming. I feel like for something that's like the most raved about concealer on YouTube, I feel like you would think that the outer packaging is better. I like thought that I got the wrong thing. <laughs> so pretty. I think this is going to be a good color match for me. Yes, let me swatch it. Hang on. Um, I don't think you can see that, but I think it's going to be good. And if anything, if it's a little light, that's totally okay. I can just use it or brighten your eyes. I'm so excited with these and now let's move on to the next box. Also got like a little sample or whatever. I'm excited. I'm gonna be doing a like makeup haul because I bought a few makeup items over the past few days. God, just seeing this makes me so excited guys. So I got two of the Too Faced Love Flush blushes. You guys know I'm obsessed with these. So they went on sale for one day during the 21 Days of Beauty. So I got them for $13. They're both half off. I got two for one basically. Oh also this is awesome. I love this brand. I really like their like sea salt spray. So I get $1 off. That's sick. Cool. And I also got perfume samplers. I don't know why, but I really like per perfume samplers. I feel like those are the ones that I actually use. I never use, like, the variety packets that they send me. Why did they send me weed? <laughs> they sent me weed. Let me swatch these. So, these are the two blushes. And here are the swatches. This one at the bottom is Your Love is King. And the one on top is How Deep is Your Love. So, this one is Your Love is King. And this one is How Deep is Your Love. I have my phone flashlight on so that you can see. I love these. They're so cute. I'm going to put them in my drawers. I'm so fucking excited. Oh, my God. Also, these boxes are so cute. I love how it has the name on it. Whatever. I'm I'm, trying. I'm so excited. Look how cute they are. They look so good. And then if I get just two more, I can put them right here. I'm just so happy. Yeah, I also like reorganized this just a little bit. Like these are my oversized bronzers and these are my oversized blushes. But basically, everything is the same. But I'm so excited. And then I'm going to put my D-Slick 
I really like this. It just looks so much more full. And then I'm gonna put my shape tape. Also, I didn't tell you what shade I got. I got the shade Fair Neutral. Yeah, also this says it's gonna last six months. <laughs> Girl, <laughs> we all know I'm gonna be using it for way longer than that. I'm so excited. Also, let me show you the applicator on this. It's fucking large. Like, <laughs> heard that it was really big, but I never really knew how large it is. Like, let me compare. Here is it, like, compare. I don't know if this, like, helps or anything. It's just so fucking big. <laughs> Whatever. Goals. I'm really excited to try it. Also, this looks like a color. So excited. Make like my dad. Never come back. <laughs> <laughs> That's so fucking sad. I love Jack's films. I'm, like, binge watching his videos, but I've been, I've, like, started, I, like, started watching his videos before he was even cool. Like, get on my fucking level. Editing the vlog that you're watching right now. Isn't that so meta? That's so meta. But, basically, this is how I edit. I make a bunch of jump cuts because I like the way that that looks, and I think that it makes it more entertaining. Jump cuts! Yay! <laughs> oh, yeah, I didn't mention what day it is. It's March 23rd. It's Thursday. It is 9.22 a.m. You guys have been asking me what time it is where I live. If you want to know, my time is New York time. It's Eastern Standard Time. So if you want to know, stop asking me. Just look it up. <laughs> so I'm back from school. Dreadful. Just sitting here admiring my blushes. They're so fucking beautiful. I put a picture on my story of them and like also this is really weird but I really like this filter. I don't know why but like for some reason I only like my eyes. I like hate the rest of my face so it's like perfect. It just like covers up everything and that's that's what I mean. Now, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm probably just gonna watch Netflix. Oh my god, it's so close to 420. Nine more minutes. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing a full face of products that I hate video. Sneak peek. The, that video is probably gonna be up before this one, so it's chill. I just need to take off my, my makeup that I'm currently wearing, my mascara, and I need to grab... I keep an extra eyebrow pencil in the car that I, like, don't actually like, so I need to go grab that because I'm not a huge fan of it. <laughs> Honestly, do I feel like filming a video? <sighs> I feel like I should film it in a different location because I feel like I always film there and I feel like it's not that cute over there. I don't know. I'm not feeling very inspired right now. I'll film it later. You guys know that feel when you're so fucking tired that you can't keep your eyes open? Me too. Look like this. Guys, so there's this girl named Olivia Carter and she's commenting on so many- She literally called me trash. She called me trash, like, seriously, which is so fucking funny. So I responded back and honestly, she just keeps saying that I have a foul mouth. She said, you have a foul mouth. And I said, and you have a foul attitude. And she's like, that doesn't even make sense. Stop liking your own comment. And I'm like, I don't like them, girl. Well, guess maybe it was one of the 2,000 people that loved me. You're literally the only one that doesn't. And I wasn't saying that to, like, take for granted, you guys. I just wanted to let you guys know I said that because she's being a bitch. And I want to show her that she's wrong. <laughs> And regardless of if she's right or not, that those comments are unwarranted and they're just rude and that she shouldn't be commenting them because she has no common sense. Like, it's not her fault. She's just uncultured and it's fine. And she's commented on so many of my videos and she keeps telling me that, like I said, she said, if I would have talked the way you did at your age, I would have had my ass beat. And I said, sex to suck because like... <laughs> That's her problem, not mine, and it seems like she's being such a bitch to me, so why would I care? But everybody else is really nice. I really appreciate all the love that you guys leave me, and I really I try and respond to everyone. So, yeah. I'm so sorry. You guys probably really don't care, but there's this chain, basically, of people telling me that I am trash. <laughs> And this girl, Olivia Carter, commented that I'm attacking her. And I said, yep, you're a victim. Maybe if you don't want me to attack you, you should just leave. It's called self-defense show, bro. She's so fucking rude. If you guys do that, that's just not nice. Like, I, I know the majority of you don't do that. Like, like, I love it. You guys are all so sweet. But the thing is, because she, like, apologized and said thank you for apologizing, I actually genuinely appreciate it. Because when somebody apologizes, honestly, I'm willing to give you another shot. If you do it again, then no. I'm so fucking bored. I'm, like, really sad. I'm so bored. And I just want to, like, brush my hair and take a shower. But I can't. I just don't want to. But I want to. Life sucks. Let's be real. Since I'm really bored, I figured that I would just answer a few of the FAQs, like right here, right now. So, my name's Annika. Annika is Swedish. My old username was Anna Carolina because my full name is Anna Carolina Osterland. And the reason why my nickname is Annika, because in Swedish, when you want to make something little, you add IKA. Similarly, if you know Spanish, you add ITA to the end of something to make something little. So, my name means little Anna. I'm 14. I'm in 8th grade. My 
camera that I use is the Canon Rebel T5i and I have a Sigma uh, like 1.4 30mm lens or something. I get into this in my Q&A and I have a makeup problem. <laughs> I am trash. I also wanted to show you guys I got two more highlighters a few days ago from Wet n Wild. So let me show you the ones that I got. Of course, I'm totally going to do a haul because I have a lot of makeup like that I've recently bought. So I got, um, there are these limited edition summer highlighters. They're the Mega Glow highlighting powders and I got the shade Sweetest Bling, which is the pink one. The purple one wouldn't work for me. I'm too light for that. Then I also got this, like the Precious Petals highlighting powder. These were both $5. This I've heard so many good reviews on. This I've seen swatches it's so fucking beautiful it's like metallic sheen and this a lot of you guys have been telling me that you really liked it um it says that it's gonna get here tomorrow by the end of the day and it's thursday 10 35 p.m somebody just unsubscribed love it so i just brushed my hair and then i washed it this vlog is awful why do you guys want vlogs right now i'm watching bella fiori guy fiori she is so beautiful. She like looks like a combination between Kylie and Kendall and like someone else. I don't know. Who. Oh my god, this eye look though. I love watching decluttering videos. I find them so entertaining. I love seeing like what people like and what people don't like and like what people want to keep using and stuff. I would do a declutter video. I, I hate decluttering my makeup. The only thing that I ever declutter are mascaras because like, I don't know, I feel like I use them up really fast. But if you want, I can go individually through each of my collections. Like I did a palette collection. I can do like a primer collection, a foundation collection, all that kind of stuff. So if you guys would be interested in that, comment down below. <sighs> so it is like 3.15. I literally slept all day. It's Friday and I got a package. I'm guessing it's from, yeah, it's from Wet n Wild. Got this package and it's from Wet n Wild. You can't fucking see. So, what's in it? Okay, hopefully it's not broken. Okay, I'm really scared. Okay, we're good. I think we're good. Yeah. They're so fucking pretty. This packaging feels really luxe and high end. It's like, yes, it's plastic, but it's like acrylic. I'm gonna swatch them. But I got this, um, this is like from their summer collection. It's in the shade Sweetest Bling, and I got their, like, this is also limited edition, but this is in precious petals. So these are so annoying to open. I will just say that. This little sticker is so annoying, but this is so cool how it's like raised. And this goes back, the lid. Sorry, I'm talking like random shit. This goes back like that far 180 degrees that was just like a one swipe across Ooh, so it's like definitely buildable that is so nice goals and dude for 4.99 the fuck you can't go wrong so this is what it looks like again opens 180 and my fingers clean so let's do one swipe oh my god oh my damn and two swipes that is really nice this um, pink one, I think, is almost a duochrome because you can see a little bit of purple. You can't over the camera, but in real life, you can. This one might be a little bit too dark for me at the moment, but it might not be. Who knows? Because from the side... So, um, I'm gonna end this vlog right here, right now, at 4.01 p.m. on, on Friday, March 21st, 24th, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching, please comment, rate, subscribe, subscribe, and bye.